Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Ben and Sin. I am Sin. This is. I don't have my wine. Ben. You gotta make it before you start it. Yeah, I can't do this without wine. Okay, I'm back. It's peach. So today, we're making sushi. You're making sushi, I'm, I'm helping. No, we're making sushi. There's two of everything. Nah, no, 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 no. no. Yes. Don't oh. fight this. We're making sushi. All right. So you, I mean, how much you? I'm doing copy and paste. Yeah, of course, because I didn't know how to do this until my little sister's sleepover, and that was one of the things that we did. She taught us how to make sushi, and I was like, okay, I have to try this. Ha ha ha. So why not try it on camera? Ha ha ha. So now we're about to make sushi. Ha ha ha. I'm excited. Ha ha ha. So we have the rice. The imitation crab, which was our choice of meat. Um, it's not really a choice of meat, it's seafood, but um cheddar cheese, cream cheese. I tried to I tried to get avocado, but um usually I was always taught that if the avocado is dark, like close to black, that means it's ripe and ready to eat, right? Um I thought that's what it meant, but I took it and it was raw, like Arr, type raw, it was nasty raw. So, sorry, Bay. I know you like zaboka, but no avocado. So, step one. <laughs> I already pre made the, the sticky rice. Good job. I'm really proud of you because of that. Thanks. So, I pre made the sticky rice. And. did this once so I'm trying to memorize her instructions you must basically have enough foil to cover the entire I don't know what this is called but to cover this thing let me try it kind of wrap it around you know what I mean First of all, let me say my little sister is the bomb.com. Because did you even measure it? Let me just say that my little sister is the bomb.com for teaching us how to make sushi because this has saved me so much money. Okay, okay, alright, okay. Come on, babe. So you wrap it around the board-ish thing. Oh, it needs to be flat on the table anyway. So, just like that. Then you carry on and on. And you You say Today, Mr. Pierpaul. What? Boom. Ouch. The best one. Come on, put it on, put it on. All square. Flat. And then flat. Alright, babe. Oh, it has to be this way. I don't want a disaster. She's, I'm gonna eat at it. I think she said the next step is the rise. Rice. This is not your typical Haitian rice. This is sticky rice. So this rice is made for sushi. So you will use your thing. Take some rice. And yes. Make sure this can really be good for some Miami rice. Right? Come on, babe. You gotta spread it out, but you gotta make sure you have enough rice that it don't look like too big but it's you 
you have to put it in kind of like a square. Last time I made the sushi at her, at her house, it was a little um on the thicker side. So I'm trying to make it a little bit on the thinner side. A smaller roll. You know what I mean? You said that was square, right? Yes, make it into a square. A little bit bigger than that big, because you can't put anything in the midst of that. Try and go out to like this area, these two lines. I'm gonna need some more rice, beans, chicken, beans, chicken. It's an inside joke. I don't want to tell what the inside joke is because said person will kill me. Who that? Hey! Don't even think about it. Woo! Go sin! Go sin! I would lift it up to show you guys, but something in my gut tells me that if I lift this, it'll like fall all over the place. So um, who taught your sister how to do this? I don't know, but this is in like a perfect square. Like, I don't know if y'all can see this, but it's pretty, it's pretty square. I don't know, it's not, it doesn't look as sticky as when, as when she made it. I don't know if I messed up. Alrighty. I followed a recipe for the rice. Ooh, the rice tastes good. Come on, babe. Don't lift it up. I have to show the people. Right? No, they can see it from the table. Just move this out the way so that they can see. Babe, that's not a square. That's a rectangle. Oh. <laughs> I need some more rice on the side. Come on, babe. You know my, geom my geometry skills. Would you like some help? A lot. Not some. I need a lot of help. Thickness into it. I think that's okay. I think that's okay. My geometry skills, man. That tells you a lot. <laughs> okay. All right. Let's see if she taught us something new. Something new. Now, you take your choice of meat, which is only one choice, so you don't really get to. You grab sick? Yes, imitation crab. Imitation crab. Okay. And then you take your additional condiments. Our condiments of choice are, can y'all see? Cover your face, babe, so that I could focus on the thing. It's probably not going to focus. It is what it is. It's cheddar cheese and cream cheese. Cheddar cheese. Cheddar, baby, cheddar. I'm saying cheddar. <laughs> Do you, see Do you want one slice of cheese or two? Two. two. I don't see anything red on those things. I still see cherry. It's not your fault. It's not your fault. <laughs> Damn. Yeah. Okay. Cheddar cheese. And then the cream cheese. I'm looking at a disaster waiting to happen. <laughs> Okay, I knew I forgot something. The seaweed. All right, I forgot the seaweed, but we got it. We got it, don't we? Yeah, because we got a phone call, so I just put the seaweed on. But um, I think now we're ready to roll. This is the hardest part. It's the easiest part. No, this is the hardest part. No, it's not. Okay, so you basically have to try and get. You done? You have right. to try and get everything into your first piece. That's why I put it all the way here. That's why I moved it. Oh, you're smart, bro. Okay, and as you roll. You tighten. You roll and tighten. I will not be surprised if some of my stuff come out the side, but it's okay. 
because you roll and tie. <laughs> you roll. This rice needs to go. And tight. Roll. I like when you say I love this one. And tight. gonna fall out bro. Move the plate. Your plate is a blue plate. Roll. Hand tight. Roll. How much rice did I lose? Oh not bad Sid. Now what if you accidentally cut my nap with the tip of the knife while you're where? playing with it? This this one has a plastic. The tip of the knife while you're playing with it. Where where is it? The entire time you've been playing games, you could have been rolling. Hold on, Jackie. Make sure you cut this one. Now I'm putting it in. Nah, 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 pull it away. <laughs> Roll and tighten. Do you need help with the first roll? Uh, Men. Our specialty. <laughs> I mean, since you started, you can just. <laughs> no! You need to finish it. Wait, let me get the first roll. Now you roll and tighten. Roll. Oh. And tighten. Do you even know what I mean by tighten? Yeah, babe. Like yeah, yeah, buddy. Squeeze and roll. You're gonna need the plate too. It's okay. Get get to your distance. Get to your distance. Keep roll and tighten. Roll. You losing all your rice, bro. You just tightening right now. You're not even rolling no more. You start rolling. You started tightening. Look. I went and got one. I went and got one. What's wrong with you? I went and got one. <laughs> Stop! I think your roll is gonna be a disaster. Go. <laughs> Wendell, I'm sorry. <laughs> I let you down, girl. How much rice did you do? Mm, not bad, not bad. But your robot is big as hell, bro. So the point of the foil is so that it's easy to come out and clean as well. I, I drank that way too fast. Wow. The wine so, is giving busy. me a head rush. Now, I don't remember how she made us take these out. <laughs> Call me. Call me. Phone a friend. <laughs> what if she doesn't answer? When I always answer. I don't know about all that. W. Why are you reading out her email? Hey. Hey sis, you are live on our Facebook video. I love Facebook live on the air. <laughs> <laughs> so we rolled our sushi rolls, right? I don't remember how to take it out. Take out of what? Of this thing. Strip like that? You just have to unroll it. But it won't fall apart? You just have to make sure that you're squeezing it enough so that it's not fall it doesn't fall apart. But you heard? Squeeze, bro, squeeze. 
You're supposed to be squeezing. Mm, 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 mm. But once you unravel it, then it should stay in its role if you squeeze it the right way, you know? Okay. And when I say squeeze it, not just like in a circle, but like actually like press it in together with your, with the pads of your fingers, like the tips. You heard? You know? Press it. Press it, press it, not just squeeze the roll, press it together, one get it. You dropping yeah. rice all over the place. That's okay. No, because I have to clean it. I have to clean it too. See, you're already eating Because the rice tastes so good. What'd you put in it? Did you use rice vinegar? Yes, I did. Okay, very good. Okay, so we're about to find out. So just unroll it? Yeah, just unroll it. Cindy, you're supposed to make sure that you don't, don't do what she did, Ben. Like, when you're unrolling it, if you, like, yeah, do that. Can I my fingers? Make sure you, like, you, you like have that? no sushi knife? Yeah, no, but I have a big knife. Okay. You just might need a towel. I'm about to, you might need to get a, a I'm wet about to towel. Give you me all your money. Get a wet, you might need to get a wet towel. <laughs> Um, so you, <laughs> you might stop. Are you? Listening? I cannot. <laughs> you better hang up. Come on, uh, this is why I can't do videos with him. <laughs> Why they call me Bob? Annoying. Nah, but. So if you get like a towel, you have to wet it and then put like the rice vinegar on it a little bit, mm -hmm. like pour the rice vinegar on it, and then you want to slice into the roll, and then after each slice, you just wipe the knife on the towel so that because it, it's sticky rice, it's just gonna get stuck on the knife if it's not a sushi knife. Wow. Experience. 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 <laughs> Well, um, I have rice vinegar, and I'm just gonna have to get a wet towel. So, so like one dozen dollars you move. <laughs> well, sis, thank you for all your help. Thank you. Right. When you watch the video, you'll be able to see if we failed or not. It doesn't look bad. It looks like you did it right. It looks yeah, but like it's not only the the look that the taste is really important too. It tastes good. The rice tastes bomb. You're not even especially tasting it. Especially if you have the especially if you have the spicy mayo. It doesn't matter. How it tastes. Mom. Chef Sin made her own spicy mayo, fam. Oh, I was gonna say, did you make that? But you didn't tell me you was making it. So. Yeah, I did. I did, I did, I did. Okay. All right, Wenda, thank you. All right. Round of applause for Wenda. Bus. Right. Love you. Love you too. Bye. All right, bye. Man, let's make the decision. <laughs> I got a paper towel, wet it, and then put rice vinegar on it. So that should, that should. Hopefully, God. Baby, eat the rice. You don't want to eat the excess? All right, put it back in the bowl then. <laughs> you look funny. Just like, so you're not gonna eat the sushi? Oh. I, I could start it here and somehow. Ooh. Might as well be the best. What, what did I tell you? No, it's stuck. Because you, your roll went over into here. Look. It's okay. <laughs> The final step? You did that one more time with Slappy for The final step? Because we don't have a sushi oh. knife, because we don't have a sushi knife, when that suggested we take a knife, Slang in some rice vinegar because the sticky rice will get stuck to the knife. 
and you just, just cut it. Cut it. This look good. It's not gonna be eight hey, can, rolls, can, but can I start? No, you can't eat mine. You have your own. I'm just cutting off this little tip because we don't need that. All right. You wanna cut your own? <laughs> I'm a master. I see what she meant. Mm -hmm. I was supposed to do it after every slice, but I didn't. Yeah. So make sure you do it after every slice. All right. So you cut your first. I'm just gonna do this. First of all, I made my pieces huge for whatever reason, but I don't question myself. I just work here. Same ingredients. That's the hands. The touch. Did I not do half of your work? Since wait. Sometimes I think you want me to end up on first forty-eight. Okay. No, not yet. What's wrong with you? Look, the first piece you cut looked crazy. Okay. I cut yours better than I cut mine. It's okay though. So now, the last thing to put, watch out, is the condiments. I made my own spicy mayo recipe that I found on Google. It's just sriracha, mayonnaise, sesame oil, Something else? I don't remember. But let me shake it. Let me squeeze it. Would you like some spicy mayo too? Probably like one or two. You said one or two? Do you want to taste it on one and then determine if you want it on the rest? I'll put it in one. No, no, I like two. I took an old sriracha bottle and I put all the ingredients in here and, and well I sh mixed the ingredients together then put it in here after I made it just to have spicy mayo for later because this recipe is pretty simple so I'm probably going to be making sushi often. Okay, I'm just trying to get the damn thing off the... I didn't. I couldn't find eel sauce, so I just got a little soy sauce. Do you want soy sauce? No. Okay. So now that it's ready, I can show you guys what it looks like. Why is it not showing? Oh no! But this is really big pieces of sushi. <laughs> but sushi nonetheless. Okay, you hey, wanna show yours? My this is States. his, he only has a couple pieces with you know, spicy mayo. Best. Get out. You need to tilt it a little bit, they can't see it. There you go. There goes Ben. Right. Okay, so. I'm about to. Get out, eat your own. I'm about to begin. When did I just text me? Mm -hmm. It's 
good, right? Went down. Next sleepover, you gotta teach us how to make something else. Cause this. Bobby mm. Julio. <laughs> that being said, we ask that you like, comment, subscribe, smash that notification bell so that you guys are notified when I post again. Without further ado. Nah, let me finish it. And then pull up them people. <laughs>